Hello and welcome to the Axicon self-help guides. Today I'm just going to show you how to calibrate your PC verifier. Once your verifier is switched on, it's a good idea to leave it for a couple of minutes to allow the LEDs to stabilize. Once a couple of minutes are over, we can just boot up the software. I've got a message to come up now to say that the uh, reader has not been calibrated. You may also get a message to say that the calibration has expired. Either way, we're going to have to calibrate the verifier. So what we need to do is to go to Options and then Calibrate. Or we can press F2 on the keyboard as a shortcut. Or we can hit this logo here on the Command window. Either way, it's going to bring up the same box, the calibration box. Now, the first thing we need to do is to make sure the minimum and maximum reflectance levels match those on the software and on the calibration card. If they don't, we can simply scroll up and down here until they do match. They should be written on the bottom right hand corner of the calibration sheet. If not, it might be on the other side. Once you have matched those, we just simply need to scan the relevant barcode. Now, if you have an Axicon 6000 series barcode verifier, you just need to scan the top two barcodes 10 times. So either the EAN13 on the left or the UPCA barcode on the right. And if you have an Axicon PC6500 or an Axicon PC7000 series, you'll just need to scan one of the bottom two barcodes, which is a GS1128 or the ITF14 10 times. Now it displays here 010, so this is how we know we've scanned it 10 times. Once we've done 10, we can just simply press OK and the verifier has been calibrated. I hope that was useful to you and if you have any questions at all about the software, then please contact us at support at axicon.com.